He's not here. As a small business owner and running into cash flow problems, is that something that should prohibit someone from being elected to office? A timely question. I know of one or more people who chose not to vote for Sean Smith because they think he's a general human being who's using and limiting the availability of those funds to his employees. I don't know that that's 100% true or not. I don't think it was an outward act or an overt one for that matter to hold back money from employees. I don't think it's actually reality that he's keeping them from their money that they're entitled to. What I do believe is that taxes and fees on business owners are onerous in this state in particular. The common perception here is that Washington State is essentially anti-business, financially oppressing businesses through taxation and discouraging them to grow their businesses. We've seen a lot of large corporations, maybe not a lot, but a number of them who have left the state of Washington because of the business climate. I don't think Sean Smith's intentions are to be devious and underhanded. I think he may very well have gone through a downturn through like the last meltdown when people quit eating because they didn't have money left to buy food with. I think it was a place where he may have gotten a little behind just trying to tread water. He's made every indication that he's attempting to right the boat and working in the proper direction to encourage business and private enterprise to continue to operate in this state. And